Good morning, everyone. Knowledge here with Reach Your Summit. I'm out here in beautiful Rhode Island this morning, and I'm going to bike the East Bay Bike Pass. It's about 14 and a half miles between Providence, Rhode Island, and Bristol, Rhode Island. A lot of maritime environment, lots of history. I'm really looking forward to this. This has got to be one of the top 10 days of the year for the summer. Low humidity, mid 80s to low 90s today. And it's packed here, so that's why I have my mask on right now. I'm gonna keep it with me in case I need it. And come along with me for the ride. So a quick side note, the maps that I used for this trip were the Appalachian Mountain Club's Rhode Island Recreation Map and Guide. This I carried in the frame bag of my bike during the ride, and this just came out. I was really excited to see Appalachian Mountain Club put something out for little old roadie. And this covers a lot of cycling options in the state, along with paddling options and hiking options, including the 78-mile North-South Trail, which I through-hiked a couple of years ago. And here you can see the East Bay bike path. In conjunction with the map, I did a little bit of extra research at home using my Rail Trails Southern New England book. This is put out by the Rails to Trails Conservancy. And this covers Massachusetts, Rhode Island, and Connecticut. There is also a Northern New England Rail Trails book for New Hampshire, Vermont, and Maine. These have been invaluable resources for a lot of car-free bike rides across New England for me. So East Bay Bike Path is described here and here with another color map. And I'm going to use this map in the video to highlight certain areas where I'm stopping, where I'm hitting points of interest along the trip. And I also ran into a couple of detours. So I'm going to highlight those as well in the video, just in case you're planning on doing this ride on your own, so you have an awareness before you head out there. And most of the East Bay bike path is part of the larger 3,000 mile East Coast Greenway which runs from Calais, Maine, all the way south to Key West, Florida. Uh, the bike that I'm using for this ride today is the Salsa Journeyman with 650B Panaracer Gravel King tires. And I have my Wahoo Element Bolt here recording the trip. Nice little hill climb, nothing too substantial. That's gorgeous.
absolutely gorgeous. This song smells so good. Take a slight detour to the carousel. I believe it's on the National Historic Landmark Registry. Should be really cool to see. About half a mile off trail. That carousel was put on the National Historic List in 1976 and still operates to this day. Every year, thousands of people riding. Built in 1895 and ceased operation this year due to COVID, but it's still awesome to stop by and see that. Turn right back up here onto the East Bay bike path. And we're gonna continue south toward Bristol. Detour here. Quick little detour over the bridge. detours. Couldn't help but stop at the second one to enjoy some turtles riding the current out to the sea. Nice little highlight of the trip.
All right, according to my computer, it's about 16.1 miles that I did. I got another 16.1 back to the car. I am down near the Atlantic Ocean. I'm gonna find a shaded spot over here and have some lunch before I make my ride back to the car. All right, I found this beech tree by the beach, pun intended. And I'm gonna have some delicious food, some bars and some macadamia nuts, and then make my way back. Pineapple upside down cake. This is delicious. Very fitting for uh, 90 degrees out right now. So if you're a fan of Moonrise Kingdom, Wes Anderson movie, just across the harbor over there is Prudence Island, one of the multiple locations they used in Rhode Island to film the movie. One last view, Bristol Harbor. Such a beautiful ride. Another 16 miles back to the car. And I think I'm gonna go get some seafood. Perfect way to end an awesome, relaxing summer ride. miles to go.
that's a wrap. I want to thank you all for joining me for a bike ride in the Ocean State. I'm about to go get some seafood. If you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, please consider doing so as I'm always adding new content to it. Hope you found this enjoyable. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the road and on the trail. Ride on.